the Kimberley is getting hotter and hotter and it's shown that uh, within the next 50 to 75 years for a third of the year the Kimberleys will become unsustainable as a living uh, environment for the general people. Speaking to our elders, what their fear is of the future is that the knowledge that they have that they want to pass on will become obsolete because the seasons have changed, the environment is uh, so different. Fishing is all we love doing up there. Hunting is what we love doing. Culture, song, dance. We have a strong culture. We want to keep practicing these, but how can we if everything's going to change with this climate? What I'd like to see is that uh, we move away from the fossil fuel initiatives that have been occurring in Australia and go towards the more renewable energy types, but also have a key uh, consultation and good relationship with the Indigenous people as well. So have it be community led from those areas. We want to ban the fracking because it's not only affecting the East Kimberley, but it's affecting the West Kimberley, it's affecting the Pilbara is affecting the whole country. Come on, you mob, stop doing what you're doing and do the right thing and think about the mob that lives in that place. Think about the tribe, think about the ancestors, think about the elders and the intergenerational change with all this. We've been working on maintaining Australia for over 80,000 years and we'd like to keep going for the future. <laughs>